Hello everyone, welcome back to Tempest Social Media. Today we're we'll taking a look at this cool little game called IDARB, or hashtag IDARB is the full name. So, or hashtag IDARB. Hey, not yet. So, this game uh, is basically a kind of like basketball game. You have to throw a ball. I don't even know how to explain it really. <laughs> it's so random. It's just. I'll get into a game. So, it's a new little indie game that was added to the Xbox, and it's actually a free-to-play game if you have gold now. So, go and get it now. It will probably be off by the time this video is uploaded on, what, Monday? So, yeah. Um, it's uh, also connected to uh, Twitch, in a way, so like people can mess with your game. Uh, but I'm not going to stream this. So, you can select loads of characters. So, you've got loads of characters, you've got loads of different colours. So I'm going to play the escapist guard just because that's what's going to Xbox soon. I'm going to pick the guard. There you go. And then if you hold down the start button, it uh, speeds up. But apparently this guy doesn't have to select the character. Let's just turn that down a bit. So those tweets at the bottom aren't actually real, I think. I'm not sure. But they could be. And if you use uh, hashtag IDUB, it might, I don't know if it shows up. So, yeah, if you connect it to Twitch, people can say, uh, like, they can type in a command, and it actually affects your game, your actual game. So if you're streaming at the time, people can type in, like, um, I forgot lo loads of the commands, but they can type it in, and it instantly messes up your game. Just waiting for this guy to, there we go, and the game is now entering. And it's the escapist guy versus old McDonald's duck. So, oh my guy has changed, so lovely. So, there you go, it just showed up Twitch. So you have to pick up the ball and you have to throw it instead of goal. You see, it's quite, it's quite, uh, it's a very well thought indie game, obviously. But apparently, but Microsoft have definitely um, helped them make this game because it is. Uh, Xbox did like do like some sort of um, advertisement for them, but yeah, it was uh, one of the free games of the month, and um, still is. So I'm not sure if it's still. Oh, you just scored a point. So you got two points, and uh, the idea is you have to score as many points as possible. So it's like basketball, really. So you get an average of about two points per goal, and you just got another one. So you get two points per goal, and then you can sometimes get like multipliers, which give you four, sometimes three. And if you just walk the ball into the goal, you can get about you can get one. But he's getting he's not actually that far ahead because this game can change very quickly. Oh dear! But obviously, the lag isn't helping me. I haven't actually learnt all the controls yet. There we go, two points. So I'm really concentrating on this game. So it is actually a cool little game and I love the art style. The art style is amazing. Oh, he's nicked the ball off me. So you, it's in no way like light basketball. But it's, it's so fun, this game. It's it's such a unique idea. And, like, you can't actually get mad at the game for losing. It's just, the game is so fun to play and just to get into. It's definitely not like one of those games that it's gonna be. Get the ball? Ah, oh, damn it. So he's winning by four points. And that, uh, and there's a cool little feature at the uh, middle of the game, which, uh, this game has got like all of like it's making fun of things as well in a way, which is it's quite fun because the game is sort of the game doesn't actually take itself seriously. It is, which is uh, quite cool because lots of games do take themselves too seriously uh, these these days, such as Far Cry 4, which takes itself way too seriously for its like like it's it's like it jokes around a lot. I'm not going to get into that, I'll probably do that in a different video. So yeah, there are these uh, orange, oh, I can't even get, I get my colours mixed up all the time. 
Oh my god, I keep missing. But yeah, there's these purple ones actually. Which you can jump through and then there's the white ones which are solid blocks. Oh, there we go. I got it in instantly. I'm only two points behind now. So the game was actually always close. Uh, so you can't actually get that far behind. Far behind is like losing by 20. And even then you might be able to recover. But let's see if we can catch up by half time. Oh, there we go. Two points. We have caught up. We need to, uh, and now we go. So that's a scoring streak. It doesn't actually give you anything, I think. It just, it's just this cool little thing. That, uh, it's a cool little texture thing. Hello, duck. Just gonna wait for you down here. And. Oh, damn, he got a goal. That's gonna be a multiplier of three. No, not three. There we go. He got three points for that because it's like a drop shot sort of thing. So now he's three points ahead already. That was only half time. Because there's four rounds. There we go, half time. And now the cool little feature we have here is the half time show. So let's get into the half time show. The the half time show is always different. Most of the time it's different. But there are quite a lot of different ones and it's it's a good way to uh, tire out your opponent. So I'll let this guy do it. So Obviously, you just have to pull, and it tires out the opponent, so that's why I'm not trying as hard. Sorry about my controller. So I'm just going to let him be tired out, just to let me recover, and he can tire himself out. There we go. So I just wanted to tire him out, so I could uh, start with like, an advantage. Uh, that actually works sometimes. That's how I've used it, because it makes them breathe a lot. So, most of the time the goals do happen just on Whoa! Never mind, I take that back. So he just got a multiple, he's, he's now double my score, which is quite unfortunate. But this game is really fun to get into. And it's definitely one of my games of the year, so that's, this would definitely, if I made a list, this would definitely be at the top right now, I'd say. Really, it's the only game I've bought in 2014. As long as we've seen, that is a brilliant game. Lots of the indie games are beginning to shine, so that's kind of cool, I think. It's giving, giving the smaller people a chance to shine. So, you get really close to scoring, and then you miss. No, I hit it away. Oops. I thought that went in then. Let's get this up. Yes, there we go, three pointer, hopefully. Three pointer? Yeah, that's a three pointer. Come on. We've still got another round, but I wanna I wanna get a win. I wanna show that I'm good at something. Go on. Uh, there we go. And yeah, end of round three. And uh Whew, we could do better. There we go, three pointer. Come on, we're back in this. So sometimes if you like bounce it off the walls, you can get like uh, times two multiplayer. And there's actually achievement, a hundred game score achievement, just for getting a six pointer, which is a uh, really cool. There are already achievements in the. Oh damn it! There's already achievements in the game, but he's now got a three pointer again. 
another one we can recover from this. So you can actually have four v four matches, and to be honest, when 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 you didn't seem that chao chaotic already, but like when you finally like, but when you played the game, it is actually quite hard to keep up with. Oh, you missed it. So you can miss from like really weird places as well. But anyway, um, yeah, like it doesn't look that chaotic when you just watch it, but when you play it. It, you can like it really you can really notice how like fast paced it is so imagine 4v4 just that's that would be very hard to keep up with oh no so close oh that went in you like ba oh that's going to be a four pointer yeah two times wait does that have four times Out of this game, out of we're out of this game. Damn it! So there's a point in this game when you know you're gonna lose, but like I've never actually like rage quit in this game, so it's really uh really fun to just play. It's it's, it's quite n um it's quite a relaxing game actually, to be honest. It's uh, very fun to uh, play. It's obviously not a game to uh by relaxing I don't mean like it's gonna calm you down. It's gonna. It's just a fun game to play. In your spare time, it's uh, leisure. But you can get annoyed when you're losing by this much. There we go. Two points. Some sort of recovery there, but obviously not enough. So I'm only going to be able to do one game. So the games are. Two point up, there we go. Not bad. Managed to keep up. But yeah. So yeah, and at the end, you actually uh, hold A to cry. And if you win, you obviously press the right stick and you go up. I'm so I'm gonna end this video here. So um, I'm not. This game is very good. I recommend going and getting it right now. So uh, yeah, uh, I'm not sure if it's on PlayStation. Oh yeah, I don't think it is because Xbox streamed it and they don't tend to stream games that are on both. But remember to leave a like and subscribe for more content and I will see you next time. Peace.